Hello friends, this is Ishwa here and in this video let us see how to install Lineage OS 16.0 on the Redmi Note 4 which is Android Pi 9.0 So it's been a long long time since my last video it is because of my exams even after that i have been uh, active in tele in our telegram group which is Asia prasad yt which i will leave the link in the description box below as you can see this is our telegram group if you want to join you can join there we have uh, messaged a lot we can uh, share our screen on times on different roms and many things like that in that telegram group so right now i'm running the resurrection dream it's rom which is on top of android 8.1 oreo and it's running pretty much smooth and again if you want to know the screen on time and any other thing related to this rom you can just join our telegram group and you can uh, get to know about anything related to our channel or anything related to tech so let us just jump into the installation of this rom First of all get into this link, I will leave a link in the description box below. This is the HDA thread in which the Lineage OS 16.0 is featured and as you can see what's working, there is a lot which is already working and the known issue is the encryption which almost no one cares and to install this ROM there are instructions which are given download and install the build and g apps and reboot recovery press the latest build and g apps reboot pretty much the usual custom rom installation instructions so for the downloads and stuff just the have a regular twrp which you have for your redmi note 4 and then download this unofficial build from this google drive link it, it just downloaded too fast and i was very happy with that download speed because of google drive so for the open apps i will leave a link in the description box below you can download with that so that's pretty much it for the downloads and also take a backup if you want to of any of your uh, apps and app data or something like that and then just reboot into your recovery now after booting into the recovery just take a backup if you want to and then just tap on wipe select advanced wipe select dalvi card cache system data internal storage no need to wipe the internal storage just select the cache and make sure all of these are selected and if you have a triple rom do make sure to wipe the vendor also so just swipe to wipe now come back select install and get into the lineage os zip file which you have downloaded and then swipe to wipe so as you can see it is patching the vendor image also so this is a triple rom which helps us to install any other genetic system image app on top of this so we can just wipe the cache and dial the cache and then come back select install and select the open g apps which you have downloaded from the links in the de description box below and then select swipe to confirm flash now after this is done just again select wipe cache and dial the cache and all you need to do is just reboot into the system and as you can see there is a lineage OS boot animation over here which is a sign that it is a successful flash and we can just get into the ROM easily now that's successful and we can just hit on next to start the setup wizard and let me just finish up the setup and get into you so here's the fingerprint let me tap on next fingerprint plus pin as you can see the fingerprint is registering good and fine and now it is just booted and for some reason it said that the backup restore wasn't completed so I think I won't be able to restore all of my apps so I have to install it one by one manually again and as you can see in the my app section there is nothing being downloaded there are still some updates to install so I need to manually install the apps one by one and that's a small irritating thing in some ROMs so as you can see the lineage OS 16 which is on top of Android 9 is over here 
and it's working very smooth and the recent screen of Android B is over here. Let me just open the camera app and let us just test if it is working properly. And as you can see, let me take a picture of this one. And it works. The front camera also works fine. And the video is over here and I think it also works fine so that's good about camera and we can also install some other cameras like the Gcam from the websites and that is going to be good so let us now get into settings and let us see the Android version as usual and Android version 9 and the sound also works fine so before getting started let me tell you the requirements it is pretty much loud enough as the regular MIUI ROMs so the torch is working fine as always let's keep it aside and let's jump into battery and as you can see 55% apps are running normally it seems and battery manager and the new volume panel as Android P and when we hold the power button we get all these options power off, restart, screenshot and the MNRG so I think that's pretty much it for the installation of Lineage OS 16 on the Redmi Note 4 I hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video hit the like button and if you haven't joined our telegram group yet just join with the links in the description box below so thanks for watching, have a great day, peace.